This is how we do my style, guys. Uh, I start loading from the from the third line, okay, and above. So that way you have room to put your tiles and then the, give it about. I'm gonna give you some tips for the guys that wanna do tile, okay? The rookie. This tile is 17 inches. So you're supposed to leave about three, three inches head lap. It means the other tile has to, has to get all the way right here. Okay, so it's 14 inches. Okay. 14. Okay. And the next step after you put the paper, load the tiles, mark your lines, the burst tile. You gotta, you gotta know how, how you're gonna end up your tile. In that case, because I have the rakes over there, I'm going to end up with the channel. So I have to measure the, on the top, I have to measure on the top, um, so I can finish with the channel. So that way, you know, all the water, when I, when I put my rakes, they, they overlap the channel, the, the channel of the tile. And this is the, my following thing I do, it's a fold the, fold the, uh, the valley metal. So you take your time, it takes you about five minutes each side or less, fold it and make sure that it's folded so that way this little lip right here, see you have about like a quarter of an inch or a little more, it's not going to let the water run on this side. Now you can make your close cut belly, you're not going to have any water like run off the belly. And this is how I install my burst up, okay. See how I did the little cut underneath the, uh, the valley? I left a little opening for the water to run off the valley. What else? Uh, my friend already cut the, uh, the pieces of tile that I need for the, for the first course and for the, for the rakes. See, I cut them in half. The, this, this time I used a, uh, a skill saw. So this is gonna be my first tile. All the way up to the like this, like this. See it? And then my my rake is gonna overlap here all the way up here. So and this is where I stack tiles. Okay, this is the way I do tiles. Hopefully, some guys out there I can help some of the guys that want to start a a trade as a roofer. So hopefully, you guys learn something on this video. And again, I'm not trying to school nobody. I'm just trying to show the new guys the new community that wants to install a rich, I mean rich uh, tile for the nail. So make a test on the on the rich board and see how how deep the nail goes. Nice. And then after that, just uh, adjust okay. it. Okay. Well, that dale un poquito más. Okay. Si adjust it. Ya se le salió. Si, pero ya ya lo regulé. Okay. Pr 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 Probably one. Probably one. And then you you put a, a tile to test. Put a tile to test and make sure that you're not breaking it. Okay. When you don't break the tile, then that's you see a perfect. You see, the nail is just flush with the tile. Un poquito más adentro. Then adjust it to the right pressure. So make sure that. Okay, clavo otra. Probably the clavos. Así. The other tip, you know, if you want to use a. Uh, okay. Gun nails, make sure you use uh, electro galvanizers, okay? Make sure this says EGs, okay? See, like this? It says EG, this is what really matters, okay? It doesn't, if it doesn't say EG, it's not electro galvanized. This ones are electro galvanized, okay? The AD nails, you can use it for framing or areas where you, you know, the humidity, the area where it's, there's a lot of rain so the nails uh, they get rusted easy so you can use EGs and they're gonna outstand the, the weather a little bit better
está, güey. Ahí quieta. Chuchón. Four hours later, here we are. We finished the whole front. And also we finished the garage already. So it took us about three hours to do this. It's taken us about one hour to do the, to the garage. And this is the way we install tile. I did the lines, the first three. How Chapin does his valley cut. He snap a lines and then he follow the, the chuck line and then he comes straight. Pa que veas pinche parra como se hace el jali. This video it's uh, dedicated to all the guys that want to learn the trade and uh, uh, the company they work at, they don't give you a chance so come over to my channel, I'll teach you how to do it just let me know what you want to learn upload the videos step by step and then you don't even have to pay me anything I'll be glad when somebody sends me a message you say Eric, thanks to you I'm a roofer thanks to you I'm feeding my family and that really is gonna really make my day you don't have to pay me anything, you don't have to thank me for anything, just hopefully you can learn the trade and uh, this is how I do it. And four hours later, like I said, I'm doing the garage. I got two lines. You see how fast the gun is? We don't mess around guys here. We don't hang nails, hang nails it takes forever. I challenge any anyone, any hang nailer to come over and and uh, beat Chapin or one of these two guys, you know, to uh, with the gang nail. And I promise you, Ch Chapin and this guy is gonna, it's gonna erase you. Okay, guys? These guys are real good. I mean, what else can I ask? I got the best crew. And this is the way we do our lines. You see, a straight straight lines. And right here on the gap, when, when we join the, uh, the valley and the garage, we don't have no gap at all. This valley right here, to make this valley together with this one, is a real challenge for most of the of the tile guys. Look how it is, straight, boom, 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 perfectly matched. So I cannot tell you the secret, but if you're a if you're a tile guy, you know this is a this is a detail. Not everybody can do it. I've seen some of my friends that work for companies that come to work with me. And they do the crooked valleys, all the lines are crooked. They do, do they do it like this, but all the lines are crooked, I mean. And they're supposed to be experienced roofers and stuff like that, but it's it's so easy to talk, but it's so hard to, to do it. See how, how how the guys do it? When you nail with the gun, you don't move the tile. And on the other way, when you nail by hand, you're moving the the tile when, when you're nailing. Because the hammering, you know, it makes a vibration. So it moves the tile. And the hand is only one snap. Boom, boom. That's it. One, one solid snap and the tile is nailed down. All right. Thank you for watching, guys. Bye-bye.